Deputy Minister of Environment and Tourism, Tommy Nambahu, says his ministry is aware that local people are being used in the poaching of elephants and rhinos. He said this during a sponsorship handover by the Environmental Investment Fund of Namibia to the Ministry of Environment and Tourism and the Wildlife Crime Prevention Unit of the Namibian Police Force Nampol in the capital on Tuesday. It's a terrible thing to be used. We know that most of them that are carrying out the, these activities are being used. The big bosses are sitting somewhere. Uh, who are receiving this kind of uh, the, 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 the proceed of this kind of heinous crime. We, we, we want them to be patriotic, we want them to be patriotic, love their country and come forward to tell us uh, uh, what is it that has been, they have been doing to, to, whist, to, 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 to proceed as whistleblowers with their, uh, there are ways of uh, earning your living or earning your money in a honest and clean way not necessarily through this kind of dubious means. The Environmental Investment Fund has availed two Toyota Land Cruiser vehicles valued at a combined $1 million Namibian dollars to the Ministry of Environment and Tourism and Nampol to aid in anti-poaching activities in and around the Etosha National Park and Kunene region. Receiving the donation, the Deputy Minister called on all Namibians to help support the Environment Ministry in putting an end to poaching activities in the country.